don't appear in space photos, despite their brilliant shine in the night sky? Many have puzzled over this, especially when they first the moon so vivid and detailed, yet the stars conspicuously absent. This absence has sparked countless questions, even conspiracy theories, but the answer is not shrouded in some dark cosmic cover-up. Rather, it lies in the intricate dance. It lies in the intricate dance of camera mechanics and the unique conditions of space. See, when astronauts like Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin set foot on the weren't just defying gravity, they were grappling with the stark contrasts of light and dark in the lunar landscape. The moon's reflective surface, devoid of atmospheric diffusion, can easily over rendering the faint stars invisible. So it's not that stars are shy. They're just too faint for our cameras to capture against the glaring brightness of To understand this cosmic enigma, we first need to dive into the world of the exposure triangle. Picture this. A powerful interplay of three elements, aperture, shutter speed, and ISO. These are the fundamental building blocks of photography, determining how much light reaches the camera sensor to create an image. Let's start with the aperture. Just like your pupils to let in more light, the aperture widens or shrinks to control the amount of light entering the camera. Moving on, we have shutter speed. Imagine blinking, while a slower blink lets in more. That's essentially what shutter speed does, it controls the duration of light exposure. Lastly, we have ISO. This is your camera's sensitivity to light. A lower ISO and a darker image, while a higher ISO increases sensitivity and brightness. Now these elements work in harmony on Earth, but shooting in space? That's you see, space lacks an atmosphere to scatter sunlight, and the moon's reflective surface is intensely bright. A Herculean task. A primary hurdle is the intense bright task. A primary hurdle is the intense brightness of celestial bodies like our home planet Earth or our lunar neighbor. These objects reflect a significant amount of sunlight, turning them into blazing beacons against the inky blackness of space. When astronauts attempt to photograph these luminous bodies, the camera's sensors get overwhelmed by the sheer amount of light. This overexposure results in the fainter stars being washed out and disappearing from the image. Another challenge is the lack of an atmosphere in space. On Earth, our atmosphere scatters sunlight, softening its intensity and allowing for more balanced photographic conditions. In space, however, there's no atmosphere to mitigate the harsh sunlight, making it even more difficult to capture detailed images without overexposure. These challenges mean that despite the incredible advancements in technology, we are still limited in our ability to photograph the cosmos from space. Our cameras, as sophisticated as they are, struggle to capture the delicate balance of light and darkness that our eyes perceive when we gaze upon the night sky. Capturing the beauty of the universe is an art as well as a science, and our current technology has its limits. While our cameras may struggle, telescopes excel in revealing the cosmic beauty. Indeed, telescopes act as our windows to the universe. Their powerful lenses and light-gathering capabilities allowing us to capture images of stars and other celestial bodies. These aren't mere snapshots, but the result of collecting light over extended periods, transforming faint whispers of photons into vibrant portraits of cosmic phenomena. The power of telescopes isn't confined to just image capturing. They provide us with a deeper understanding of the universe, letting us peer back in time to witness the birth of stars, the spiral arms of distant galaxies, and the fiery dance of celestial bodies. This technology has opened up avenues of exploration and knowledge never before imaginable, turning the cosmos into our personal laboratory. The journey through space is indeed incredible, and while capturing it perfectly may be a challenge, it's one we'll never stop pursuing. Because after all, the universe is ours to explore and understand.